Hi, it's time for another math easy solution. Trying to discuss a pretty useful video on unlocking uh, PDFs by basically a quick uh, little trick I sh I learned earlier uh, by printing to PDF using any PDF printer program. But first of all, in my earlier video, I showed how to copy and paste from a locked PDF by simply opening the PDF in a browser such as Firefox uh, through using basically Dropbox or any other online PDF viewer. You can see more on this in the video link below in my earlier video. But in this video, I'm going to show how to basically permanently unlock any PDF. Uh, all you need to do is simply print it to PDF using any PDF program, printing program. You might have one built into your computer or, or whatnot. But uh, but basically, before uh, in order to do this, you need uh, basically a protected PDF that, that allows printing. If it doesn't allow printing, then you can't print a PDF. So this is basically unlocks most PDFs. A lot of them, they do a lot of printing. And basically, I recommend using Bullzip PDF printer. It's a free uh, PDF printer. I go to bullzip.com. You just go there. Here's the, the site. And you just click on free download, and etc. So you just play with that one over there. So what I mean by um, by uh, having a locked PDF, you probably have heard of this. So basically, if I uh, scroll through here, so let's make this a bit smaller. So uh, yeah, so then this is a locked PDF. I open it. I had to basically uh, type. Th this was just a random calculus question, which I use in one of my videos. But I, I needed to copy and paste this into uh, Microsoft Word. But then this is locked, as you can see. If you right click, I can't right click. I'm trying to. You can't. If I go one word, I'll just go right click. I can't do that. Even if I go to edit. Yeah, all the copy paste, every everything is hidden. So, like I showed in my earlier video, you could open this in a browser and you could do that. But if you want to permanently, uh, permanent, yeah, permanently uh, unlock this, all you do is go to File, go to uh, just basically Print as a PDF. I'll just drag this in here. So, so I have a default bullshit PDF printer. Uh, I usually make a default on this just in case I accidentally print something on on um, on, on my actual printer and a physical copy, and I don't really. One is a mistake. That's why I'll print on PDF and then check. So, anyways, if I go to print, then it uh, asks where, basically where to save it. Let's see where this is. This is my stuff here. Go to the new folder. Is that? I'll just call this locked PDF. I mean, unlocked PDF. Uh, so that let's just save it there. Okay, and it automatically opens up, or you could even, uh, yeah, so this is, that's the one, let's close this. I'll go to the unlock PDF right here, and as you can see, I right click, whoops, uh, let's get the right click, and so right click, there's a copy there. So I can copy, and now I can go to here, and paste, etc. You could go paste, uh, match destination. So as you can see, this could save you a lot of time, let's undo, and get back to it. As you can see, if you go to edit, uh, there's a copy, there's a paste, as you could, uh, it basically prints exactly, uh, what the PDF document had, but then it uh, it's basically unlocking it. It it's just a trick to unlock. Is you're not really unlocking it. All you're doing is printing the exact stuff into just an unlocked uh, PDF by default. Yeah. So then this is pretty uh, useful. Hopefully. Uh, well, anyway, that's all for today. If you learn from this, try try it out for out for yourself. This will actually save you a lot of time if you're dealing with uh, locked. PDFs or papers for school or whatnot, so it's gonna save you a lot of time. Anyways, that's all for now. You can download these uh, notes as well as well as the uh, locked and unlocked PDFs all in the Dropbox link below. And uh, thanks for watching, and stay tuned for another math easy solution.